Yeah. We young ballers in the market, we gon' light up. We got Mike McDade and he's mic'd up. New trends in the show, he's gonna write up. I'm just a college kid, but he still gets me hyped up. Yeah, I'm learning more about the C store. I never back down from the fear, I'm trying to see more. I'm with Mike and he's mic'd up. New trends, he's gonna write up. We watch the city light up. I'm with Mike and he's mic'd up. I'm with Mike and he's mic'd up. New trends, he's gonna write. Monday, we're headed to Boston for the Pine State show. Um, actually, headed to Maine today, and it's gonna be a long, good week. Associated. Looks like their flight was delayed. The setup today is only till five, but they've got uh, something special going on tomorrow morning before the show starts. They've got the, um, the sales team coming around to their booth and getting educated on their product to help sell it with us tomorrow at the show. So we're gonna have to set up their booth for them as well. Let's just hope all the products there. reaches completely over and taps me and wakes me up and asks me if I need a drink. What airline? American Airlines. American Airlines. Shame on you, American Airlines. Listen, less, do less. Wake, don't wake us up when we're sleeping on the flight. That's much needed. I sleep the entire time on flights because I get none at home. <laughs> Appreciation. We got Ryan Shaw helping throw together the associated planogram. My vendors are the best vendors. Done setting up. We got Bob Marley giving us a good comedy act tonight. Yeah. I'm fired up. We gotta clean up though. We gotta we gotta we're in a rush, so let's go. I gotta get ready. <laughs> so here we are. It's a little bit cold out, they got piles of snow still, but we're just gonna come in and close a bunch of deals. It's what we always do. We just dominate these shows. Last night we had a real good time. We had Bob Marley, not the Bob Marley you'd hope for. We had Bob <laughs> Marley the comedian. Um, he was really funny though, so we got to enjoy him and uh, everyone got to bed nice and early, so we should see everybody at the show. Uh, no, nobody hung over. <laughs> Yeah, 
So we're an all natural energy drink. We have 90 milligrams of caffeine from green tea extract, four natural sugars deliver the carbs that deliver on the energy, and it's an all natural, healthy way to do an energy drink. I'd love to try it. Come on, Mike, give it a shot. We'll do. Show. Uh, we've been here before and a uh, great customer base. Uh, we're really excited about some of the new offerings we have this year. Uh, everything's guaranteed and uh, we're really here to help drive incremental sales both on the part of Cormark as well as the retailers. Um, and uh, we've got some new and exciting things including our summer activity rack which is really fun for the uh, for the kids and for the adults. And we've got our outdoor adventure rack here as well. Uh, and then our candy rack in the back here, which uh, does really well. Um, so really excited and uh, happy to be here. story thinking about it right now is um, at this show five years ago my first time ever fly up to Augusta do this show then I got to drive down to Mass for the show on Thursday one of their sales reps actually several of them asked me hey are you going to Worcester and I say yeah yeah I'm going to Worcester in my head I'm thinking I booked my hotel in Worcester and um, so I'm sort of having an anxiety attack. I'm young, you know, green and don't know where the hell I'm going. Probably didn't have enough money for an extra hotel room for the night. So I'm panicking. Eventually I asked somebody, I said, hey, I gotta tell you something. I can't find Worcester. I booked a hotel in Worcester and they said, and they bust out laughing, right? Turns out that's just how they say it. Okay, with, listen up, exhibitors, at this time. With that horrible Boston accent. So, embarrassing but funny story. Which happened to me two, two uh, well, three weeks ago. Same thing. I said, Where's Worcester? And the guy started laughing. He goes, It's not Worcester. It's Worcester. Or however you pronounce it in the Boston accent. Hey guys, show's over. It was packed. It was a good show. We're headed down, what, we've got 110 miles, down 95, headed over to Worcester, Massachusetts. Get in tonight, go to dinner, go to bed. We got Chain Summit tomorrow, so it was a good day. Good day, we'll see you tomorrow. Just got to the DCU, so we got to set up, and uh, we got the one-on-one -on -one meetings. Right now, we just gotta go get a dolly because we gotta do upstairs um, for all the one-on-one -on -one meetings and then we gotta unload and, and, and put everything downstairs for the trade show tomorrow. charging station and I've set it out where we're gonna have the cocktail hour and a little casino night last year I think I made about a million dollars so you know tonight I'm gonna probably match that maybe try to beat it but uh, it's gonna be a good night it's gonna be a good, good time what we do here is go back 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 back
off our tables. Everyone's asking for samples. Uh, it's winding down. The band's still playing. It's good vibes in here, but um, it was a great, great show. And you know, it's, it's getting about time for us to pack up. So we'll just see you. We know we're headed to the airport after this and back to Pittsburgh.